Hey Chomi, welcome back to Gossip Cafe. My name is Kay. If you are new here, welcome honey. If you are returning, Sabi, thank you so much for gracing us with your presence once again. Your love and your presence is highly appreciated over here. So guys, without further ado, let's jump straight into this video because honey, honey, oh, things are happening out here. And who am I? That's not a secret I'll never tell. You know you love me. XOXO. So before we jump into the whole things um, that we are about to talk about on this video, please don't mind my crumbled shirt because wow, I just woke up and I said, <laughs> I need to take this video. I need to take a video because wow, I'm not ironing any jack shit. I'm going to sit there and deliver what I need to deliver. Okay? So please don't judge me because I know, I know on YouTube at the moment they come for you for anything. You entertainment industry in the streets of YouTube entertainment. YouTubers, ah, in this pet and sana is a pet. And in this pet and so you part take it die. <laughs> I'm just kidding guys. So, um, as I said, we've got just a few topics to just go down on and um, we'll be done, alright? So, we're going to start with the Queen of Africa, Ubu Makazi. Makazi has just dropped her new album. It is called or titled um, African Queen. 2.0 and let me tell you guys let me just give you something like small onion and just small onion so i do not i'm not that much of a fan of uh, makazi's music okay and um but i'm a huge fan of makazi i don't know if i'm making any sense i do not i am not a fan of her music that much i'm for the past couple of of of, of her albums I, I had like few songs that I liked maybe also it was not songs that were popular or songs that were released as singles it was just music and um, I always find that um, there's something missing I, I love Makati but there's something missing in her albums that I need maybe I will definitely fall in love with her music don't get me wrong I'm not saying her music is trash and stuff like that it's just that it didn't it didn't I didn't connect with the music okay so I literally waited for this album because I felt like there's something that she's coming with with in this album there's something that I might fall in love with the music okay fine day before yesterday she obviously she announced way back that she will be dropping um, the new album midnight day before yesterday right and literally the last time i waited for music to drop is it is when we had cds i remember it it, it was um it was adele's um cd i think it was what 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 is it was 25 or 19 or something like that but it was um it was adele's music and i had to go and queue up for an, a cd player at tiger valley mall here in cape town I went and I was the first person at the door and people just came and they were queuing up for this um, for this Adele's music. It, it was so exciting. I don't understand. Obviously, the moving of the times and, and, and changes and stuff like that. Now we don't have to go and buy albums and stuff like buy CDs and stuff like that. But that was so exciting. So literally, day before yesterday, I was glued and waiting for the music to drop. Early hours of the morning, yesterday early hours of the morning, obviously after midnight, the CD or the, the, the music was officially on or the, the, the album was officially dropped. Ooh, let me tell you, I listened to each and every one of those 22 songs, 22 or 21, I don't, I don't remember, I'm not going to check now. I listened to those th those songs all of them and i said yes this is what i'm talking about this is what i was waiting for for this whole damn time i think this is makati's um, most defining moment most defining album this is the work of art this it's it's just the perfection 
of representation of African Queen. This is perfect. I love each and every song that she had. Diti Salad, everything is there. I'm a piano, um, pop, pop um, Af Afro pop, Yoinke Lendo, like it's mixed and it, it, it talks to each and every one of us. It's, it's just a work of art. It is a work of art. This is what I, wait, I was waiting for. This is a legendary album from Akadze. This is, you will never get anything better than this from her anymore. The musicians have got that one album that they had and it defines their work. And this is what I'm talking about, defining Makati's work. This album is defining her work. Oh, this was too long. It might just be a video by its own. But anyway, let's move on because other topics are not that long. Anyway, let's move on. So we are talking about Deben Gogo. Deben Gogo signed a deal with a Play Energy drink brand. So I am so happy for her. She is a coining all the time and definitely she does work hard. But does she? Does she really work super hard that she's getting all these bags that other, other creators or other musicians other singers or other people, like ordinary people who are in the entertainment space, are not getting. We all know that Devin Goko is coming from a very wealthy and powerful family in South Africa, right? So, I wouldn't put it past that she is also getting an influence from her background. She is getting all these bags, sometimes part of it. It's the privileges of having a powerful rich family. You get bags. You are trusted by a lot of companies to represent their brands. But anyway, congratulations to Devin Gogo. You deserve it. Um, obviously, I don't know anything about what is happening in the background and how your family is influencing your success in the entertainment industry. So moving right along, Gamum Pella is one of the creators who were selected for the um, class of 2023 Black Voices um, YouTube or YouTube Black or something like that. So um, congratulations to her and obviously she does deserve it but I do not understand the YouTube Black funding necessarily if it will go to people who are already established, people who are very big. Um, Gamumpela is big. She is a big, 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 big at this point of time. She's almost at a peak of her career or she is at a peak of her career at a very young age. Choosing her and um, funding her, her creation is like going to Mutsipe and say, I will give you a business um, or go to Mutsipe and say, I'm going to fund your ideas. Like, fund whose ideas? Like, you fund someone who is already funded, someone who is very well established. Obviously, we all need money. We all need money to pile up and pile up in our banks and, and our properties and stuff like that. But we've got a lot of YouTubers who deserve to be selected unless a lot of them they did not apply for the whole thing but we've got a lot of musicians that will need or that will use that boost of the funding from YouTube to boost their their own creation to be able to 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 afford um, music videos afford to record new music and all of those things Gamupela doesn't have a problem with recording music you know she records music she collaborates she, it's she's everywhere she's everywhere she's got endorsements and all of those things I find it unfair that YouTube only give this this um, money or funding or um, YouTube black the whole thing of 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 um, of working with the um, artists or creators that are already out there and well established where is the funding for people who are doing very well but they they are not seen they and they don't have any financial pushes at the back because YouTube is very expensive to maintain very expensive especially for someone who will sit in front of the camera like I do right now you need all those gadgets your cell phone or your camera or whatever you need all of them you need data to actually post something 
um, it doesn't come cheap. I know there's a lot of people who say, ah, YouTube is so cheap to you, 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 YouTube. It is a topic for another day. Definitely, I will talk about it one day. YouTube is definitely not cheap. You need to cough out money in order for you to get the money back to you, right? It's like a business. Anyway, let's move right along. Um, we're not moving anywhere because this is the end of the video. Thank you so much for watching till this far. I hope and pray you'll stay for another dose of content and please do subscribe if you're not subscribed and make sure that your notifications um, are, are on, okay? And um, I'll see you on my next video. Thank you so much and have a fantastic one. Bye.